lemons. It's Joss here for ICM Friday. So I believe the theme uh, was switched over. Um, it was meant to be CCN's Got Talent, but I see now it's been um, changed to the Supernatural theme. Uh, I don't know. So we're going to do Supernatural today. Which is... Okay, hope you're all sitting comfortably. There is. I'm reading this off the internet, by the way. Um, I'm going to tell you a quick sort of urban legend or something. There is an urban legend in my town, I'm quoting by the way, in my town of Kokomo, Kokomo, Indiana. We have many urban legends in fact, but there's one in particular. The story is set on Old Sycamore Road, which is an old road in the farmland, um, oh, which is an old road in the farmland, um, an open area of my town this really needs to make sense a bit more. There's a small bridge off of Old Sycamore Road that takes you onto another road that leads to the next town. The story goes uh, a man or a boy fell off the bridge and died hitting his head on the rocks underneath and if you were to drive on Old Sycamore Road at night and across that bridge then the ghost of the man or boy um, Appear, appears next to your car once you pass the exact spot they had fallen from until you exit the bridge. My friends and I have tested this urban legend many times and we have yet to see anything. Hmm. Figures as much, doesn't it? We don't even know if anyone really died there. But true or false, it's an eerie story and visual. This was submitted by someone called John. I call bullshit. I'm not too sure about supernatural sort of stories and such, but I'm into superstition. I mean, you know, the whole thing about magpies and everything, you know. One for sorrow, two for joy, three for girl, four for boy, five for silver, six for gold, seven for a secret never to be told. Um, I'm into that stuff. Walking under ladders, um, yeah. Black cats, not so much. Up, um, a floating upright tea leaf? Yeah, that's good luck. I believe in that as well. And four leaf clovers? I've picked one. I've had good luck for some time. Um, but as for stories, sure, they're pretty freaky and, well, they're a crack joke to me, to be honest. I just enjoy hearing about them. But if it's a true story, like, you know, something related to murder, but, you know, the haunted stuff makes it all seem a bit too. Oh uh, no, childlike, childish. However, I'd love to hear them. I mean, I think it's cool. What stories have you been hearing? I'd like to know because this is just from the internet. I know my friend Ellie has told a few to me, but Jesus Christ, I can't even remember them. They're better than the ones I'm finding. Alright, this is a very quick video. I'm sorry, I'm a bit tired and I'm off to Expo on Saturday, so yeah. I'll pr you could probably see me around in my black coat cat cosplay, so yeah. Love you guys. Dross Friday out. Bye.